everyone and welcome back to Magic Gathering Strat. I'm Binky B and this will be the final match in this Magic Origins 8-4. We lost the die roll again. What a big surprise. But it's okay. I mean, I don't think this deck is that fantastic. It doesn't have that good uh, ag aggressive curve that you're actively looking for in this format. But we have been fortunate enough to draw our early spells early. Even though it has been on the cost of mulligans and uh, missed land drops later and so forth, but it's okay. So, do we want to play or maybe he went for a sandwich? I would not turn down a sandwich right now. So. We will see. I'll be right back. Alright, we have connection. Decent hand, we will keep. Actually one of the better ones, I think. Black. Oh, that's a good one. Now we have the nice 2, 3, 4 curve. And aesthetic is not horrible either. And against the red black, I really like Dragon Fodder actually, so that's good. Well, that's not as good. <laughs> uh, let's just play Blessed Spirits and pass. Could have played Titan Strength, but I'd rather use up all my mana. He could have enchanted with the flying thing or whatever. No, Skyraker. No land stinks. I can trade a Goblin token for one of his creatures. I would like to use my mana. If he just takes it, then it's fine. Double blocks, you're giving me the choice. I'm definitely killing that. Yeah, I will take that. Let's put everything there. And pass. Alright, so now we have suppression bombs. We can play the tactician. Yeah, now of course you attack, but that's fine. So I lose two. Yeah, it's okay. And Acolyte. I do not like that. It will be hard for him to get. Yeah, I think you play the tactician. It will be hard for him to get this past everything. I suppose if he has a removal for this, I have to chomp. I guess I don't have to, I can suppression bonds it. Okay, I'll be fine with this. Yeah, I take a lot of damage, I get it, but it's fine. Well, that stinks, though. Let's play this, and uh, he can sack it to an two cards, that's fine. The way he tapped, he cannot return the, the spoiler, which is good. And since I drew Auromancer, I don't really care if he uh, sacks this to an two cards, which he probably will. Jesus, you have everything. Yeah, that's nice. Healing hands is not a bad draw either. But for now, this will do. Yes. Uh, do I attack? Can I take... Let's see, you return that, you take 4, 6, do I take 9? I block, that's 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, yeah that's 9 damage, and if he has any creature I die, unless I, I guess I can just block this, 
Uh, actually, I won't attack. Feels like I will win if I can survive a couple of turns. So I can sack the ascetic, no problem. Or discard it rather. Probably one prickle bore as well. I kind of like the healing hands here. So the spoiler is coming back, it seems. Yes, so we will have something to uh, to throw. I guess I could block both. <laughs> is it better to bo block both of those? Then I take two. Or do I rather him sack this? I take less damage this way. This is tough. There is no point where I can suppression bonds the Nantuku husk. I guess, yeah, I should actually have attacked, I think. Because now I, I'm, I'm not going to block. Because I will suppression bonds next turn. Yeah, that's not good. Should have attacked, but uh, probably not actually. Uh, we'll throw that. Okay, fair enough. So now we will suppression bonds this. No, then we die. That's not good. Not good. So now we have have to play healing hands. Uh, this this did not work out as well as I would have hoped. Guess we play that. So now we can block husk. That would save us the most damage. Uh, cruel revival is not good. Then we're dead. Okay. Super aggressive and a good draw, but I think our draw was okay. But not when he drew in that manner. So Shannon's Fury seems okay. Heavy infantry, probably not. Aura monster could be okay. Yoked ox seems okay. Sidearm seems bad. Ascetic seems pretty bad too, but at least it trades. I'd rather do this, I think. Yeah, I would like to play first. This is a hand. I will keep it, but it's not good. It contains two cards that are good for me to have. But I need to draw something. A three, two drop or a three drop would be the best. Or a mountain. Mountain is also good. Just the fact that I don't have... Um, oh god. This is something that happens in Modo a lot, I think. You keep a land heavy hand and you draw a lot of lands, even though the statistics says that you should not. Yeah, well, that will die at least. See, this hand, or this draw, I would have beaten last turn without a problem. Last game. No, I don't think so. I have a 5 drop and a 6 drop, I don't need Yoke Dogs. Okay. That is good. He does have cruel revival, I think. Yeah, I think it's fine. Yeah. That would have been a disaster. If I played Hexes.
Now we'll play Evan Battle Priest just to maximize the mana. If he attacks, that's fine. Sure. Just gonna block. Okay. I can actually play that. Yes. Yeah, I like pre combat spells. Well, I don't like that uh, particularly, but okay. I like that I will get to Hixes him. So, which one of his creatures do I kill? I also don't like that Enthralling Victor turned into a removal spell. I guess he's kill this. I need to draw something, so... I guess if he kills in, uh, my Hyxus, I actually get to... Um, to get my free blade back, so that's good. <laughs> we drew a land, and I'm not land. <laughs> This is good. We're so screwed. Uh, Ravaging Blaze is a good one, but we don't have spell mastery, so. Okay, that one is good. And I think here's the attack. If Hixus dies, that's too bad, but. That's one of the better cards I could have drawn. Okay, whew. Flooded like crazy. But two good rares and... You don't have to care. I don't think I have anything else I want to bring in. I have a few good early drops that could keep me alive. And that's all I can ask for really. See, this hand is pretty good. Got a 1 drop and a 2 drop and a combat trick. Try to get past my ox. You can cruel revival that if you want. Sure. Now I don't mind the lands that much, but I guess I don't really need to wish for them. Sure. Uh, I will block here. Sure. I mean, that that's going to happen no matter what. <sighs> and pass. To not have a 3 drop here is pretty bad. I do like the fact that my opponent has to do something if he wants to attack with the call blade. Just with that. I think you just take it. I would like to draw more cards, but Okay. Dragon Father. Hmm Yeah. I suppose. So next turn I can actually be a bit tricky if nothing changes. Uh, that did change a bit. You're gonna attack with everything. Yeah, well, I will block. Block, I think. Or I can double block here. Hmm. I don't like taking three, but I like that Chandra's Fury is going to do something. Uh, <coughs> no, I'm just gonna do it like this. 
Let's see what you got. Fiery conclusion. You sacked your Nantuko husk. Okay. Then I will have to trade Titan Strength, but that's fine. No, thank you. And since Chandra's Fury is no longer good, I'm happy to discard it. If I had, if I know, knew I was gonna draw another land off the top, I would discard planes, but. See, that's a good one. Hopefully he won't make me discard, but he's hellbent, so. And he just slams. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. Hmm. I guess I used attack. Don't have anything else to do. Oh, ravaging place. And I do have spell mastery. One, two, three, four. So this will hit for five. I think I just... Ah, I'm just gonna play this. Hopefully it will survive. It's so much better for me if it does. I will take it. No problem. Okay. Now I get to attack for 9? So I assume something is coming here. Then that makes no sense. That attack. Then the game is basically over if you don't have anything. I will let you attack. Sure. Boom. Yay! Success! <laughs> Thanks for watching, I'll bring you more videos as soon as I can. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, it really helps us out. You can find us on Twitter at MagicGathStrat, Facebook slash MagicGatheringStrat, or on the web MagicGatheringStrat.com. There you can find articles and free prize-supported leagues. This is all brought to you by our Patreons and CardHoarder.com. If you enjoy this content, please consider supporting us at Patreon.com slash MagicGatheringStrat.